Hello everyone and welcome in. I hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, viewers, and the world out there. Today we're looking into Libra's new love reading for the month of May. We're just going to jump right into the energy here, Libra, and see what we can see. We're going to look into this person's energy, challenges you may face, how to prepare Also, guys, if you find the messages helpful, resonating with your situation, please give it a thumbs up. All the love and support is very much appreciated. It does help with the growth and getting the message out. And if you like the vibe of how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So let's dive in here, Libra, and see what we can see for your upcoming energy for May. Most important message here for Libra spirit. What do my Libra friends need to see? definitely feel here Libra your next person is the one that you're going to be with for a long time we're going to clarify all of this energy here in a minute feel in the present energy Libra you may be holding on to a situation a person from your past that maybe has ran its course or this person could have even left, guys, even ghosted you. Because this is your energy, Libra, this middle row. This is your energy. So let's move through this. The energy surrounding your person is the Three of Cups. I feel like this person is going to be ready to move forward very quickly. I also feel like this is a person who you've possibly been friends with for some time, Libra. And we see here the king and queen of swords. So you could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But there's definitely a match. And I feel like this person feels a strong connection with you, Libra. Um, even though you guys are maybe just friends in this present energy. Okay, so we're going to clarify all of this right now. Your energy, Libra, even though you're offering this new love or you portray like you're ready to move forward in a positive direction, I feel like there's something that's holding you back, okay? And I honestly feel here, Libra, taking some time to clear up these past emotions or really being honest with yourself about that past person is going to help you to... Be more open to this connection moving forward. The challenge here, Libra, two of pentacles. You're still up in the air. You're still holding on to this past. Or I feel for a lot of you, this past person isn't really even present in your life. It's almost as if you're still healing from that situation. I do feel like being open to moving forward with this person who is your friend and may have shown some interest already is going to be it's going to be in your best interest i feel like this is your love connection um, that you've been looking for so let's start by clarifying this three of pentacle or three of cups excuse me this is your person's energy the energy surrounding libra's person spirit what do my libra friends need to see Mm -hmm. I feel like this person is bringing in a different type of energy than what you're used to. I feel here this person is bringing balance. It's bringing instability to your life and helps you to get out. Because I honestly feel here, Libra, that you may be kind of isolating yourself from the world, focusing on work. And then when you get home, just kind of doing what you need to do. Okay. King of Swords here is how they feel about you. I feel like this person looks at you, Libra, as maybe closed off emotionally or holding back emotionally how you truly feel or what you're going through. 
I also feel here that they sense that you're keeping things on a friendly level on purpose. Now, again, being open to something more with this person, it's going to help you to heal from this past loss. Please clarify the outcome here, the Queen of Swords for Libra's person's energy. Mm -hmm. This person sees a future with you, Libra, but I feel like this person is also very clear about you needing to reconcile your differences from the past, whether this is getting closure on this past situation or whether this is letting go of a specific person altogether. There's something from your past that you need to let go of, and I feel like this person is very aware, very aware of what is going on there, okay? Your energy here, the energy surrounding you for the month of May is this, the Ace of Cups and then beautiful, beautiful energy, Three of Cups, which is ma matching your person's energy very well here, Libra. I definitely feel like there is an intense connection between the two of you, and right now, you guys are keeping things on a friendly level because I feel like whatever it is that you've recently gone through has really kind of threw you through a loop. Maybe unexpected, not really expecting this was the outcome. Clarifying this King of Pentacles, this is how you feel about them, okay? I feel like you feel like this is a very close friend okay eight of swords is on the bottom of the deck so i do feel like you kind of when this person maybe pursues you, you kind of overthink things a little bit and maybe even compare this person to this past situation that you've recently left or disconnected from Please clarify this five of pentacles for the outcome here for Libra. What I feel here, Libra, is this can go one of two ways, okay? You could move forward with this person towards a new beginning, an intense connection, um, focusing on the future. Or you can hold back, wait for this past situation to clear up. But if you wait too long, I feel like this person could move on to something else, which is fine. If that's the energy, there will always be the lesson present when you're ready. But I do feel as if there is an intense connection between the two of you. This may be somebody you're not wanting to lose, Libra. So let's clarify this two of pentacles. This is the challenge here, Libra. The two of pentacles is clarified by the four of pentacles and the chariot in the reverse. So there's a pause. There's a pause that's happening here in this connection. And I feel here it has a lot to do with whatever transpired in your past. Okay. Try to be honest with yourself about this situation because I feel like this new person that's coming in here, Libra, this is an intense connection, okay? This is your soul tie connection. However, because of the past and the hurt and the pain, the agony that you felt, it's hard to envision a new beginning with another person. Take some time and be strategic when moving through this energy. That's what I feel is the best piece of advice. Let's clarify this three of wands and then we're going to dive a little bit deeper into the energy. We're going to see if there's anything hidden. We're going to look how to prepare and what's the best advice moving forward. Having patience with this process is going to be key. Again, Libra, I feel like there's a lot of love. And I also feel like you may be surprised on how quickly you start to accept this person into your life a little deeper. So let's pull out this other deck for you guys. We're going to tap into the hidden energies here for Libra. Now, if you find the messages helpful resonating with your situation, please give it a thumbs up. Anything hidden that Libra needs to be made aware of here, Spirit, let that come to the forefront of the reading.
I honestly feel here this is your energy, Libra. This past situation that you're escaping from is what I feel like is really what's holding you back from moving forward in other areas in your life as well. In other areas in your life. I feel also that this person isn't shifting in their energy. They most likely are guarded or going through their own healing process. And it's almost as if that was like a karmic situation that you're needing to release. And that is what's difficult. Sometimes in life, the lesson will come back around until we learn that specific lesson. The karmic lesson that we learn through that connection is what's associated to that karmic connection. I feel here, Libra, that your past person isn't shifting in energy. I also feel if you truly want wanted to wait around for that person that the opportunity would be presented again but because they're in the same energy it's going to be the same outcome so why not try something different i do feel like moving forward into this new connection new relationship this new love interest it will be beneficial for you not only is this an, a more intense connection a more stable connection I also feel here, Libra, there are a lot of, there's going to be a lot of opportunities for you to heal, to find balance. Because of the stability that this person is exuding, it's going to be easier for you to find that stability and balance within yourself. It is true that people's energy do rub off on us, whether we like to admit it or not. So how to prepare for this energy, for this connection, for this new love interest for Libra. We have the Knight of Staffs in the reverse. We have the Wheel of Fortune and we have the Star energy. Okay. So I do feel like there is a need to make a decision here. I feel like once you make this decision and you have a conversation with this person, Things are going to move forward very quickly in that connection. I feel like there will be a need to have patience, though, because you will be triggered about this past scenario. And just having that understanding and being honest with yourself through that energy will help to move through it quicker. There is a level of healing, a level of balance, a level of stability that's coming out here in this connection. I do feel like you and this person have a deeper connection than what you envision. Because I feel like you keep discrediting this person as like, this is just a friend, but I feel like this is a friend, a person who's been a friend for a very long time. So, Libra, your advice, guidance, moving forward here in this energy, we have the strength, we have temperance, and the Knight of Pentacles. So, acceptance is going to be the key. Accepting the past situation has ran its course. That person isn't changing. And accepting that there may be more here to this person that is being channeled than what you envision. Because I honestly feel for you, Libra, this person is somebody who you have already had a friendship with. But I feel like there's something deeper than what you both are wanting to admit. You're going to come around very slowly, but I honestly feel like this person is willing to have patience with this process and you guys being on this friendly level helps to, helps to feel secure, okay? Especially when you're having conversations or expressing yourself to this person being open. Friendship is definitely a good start to a solid foundation, guys. So this, I do feel this is a good connection. This is exactly what you've been looking for, Libra. So trust the process here. Let's pull out a few of these romance angel cards to sum up your reading. Thank you guys again for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. Libra, reconciliation, chemistry, release your ex. So this may be somebody from your past. Okay, but I definitely feel like this is more of a friendship. 
I feel like this person is getting ready to come forward to you and express to you how they truly feel. So prepare for that. But I do feel like there is definitely a need here, Libra, and it's coming out very clearly in all sides to let go of this past situation. So, Libra, I feel like that's a good solid message coming out. Thank you guys again for all the love and support, and I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.